started painting murals in, in 98, uh, up in Portland, Oregon, for Artifacts Murals. And I, I worked with some of the some of the best painters in the business, you know, guys that were down here in LA in the you know 60s, 70s, 80s, all the way up until until vinyl took over. Just learning from those guys, I, it's like a whole nother education. I think I've painted over a million square feet of murals. I mean, at times we're, I painted buildings that were like 220 tall by 100 feet wide. You know, so that's like 20,000 square feet right there. And for a while there, we were doing those, you know, once a month for, for years back to back. Lately though, it's been a lot of smaller walls, just more intimate, like street level kind of campaigns. There's only so many people left that even know how to paint this kind of stuff. So it's, you know, there's maybe 20 to, to 50 billboard painters left and half of those are probably 50 to 60 years old. So I mean, there's really only maybe three or four companies left that do the hand painted stuff. kind of, you know, the, the, the printed billboard, the machine took over and just knocked all the, all the artists out. Today, uh, my goal is probably just be able to, to do most of the like sky and water down to here, maybe save, save Homeboy for tomorrow when we're fresh. It's more or less having it all based in, not a, not a totally finished product. It's just three, three and a half painting, and then um, uh, it takes about two or three hours for coat out and pattern and all that. So, you know, five hours in, five or six. I think we're in good shape. I got as far as I thought we wanted to. 